Okay, so we're going to classify each of the following events here, uh, a sets of events here as mutually exclusive or non-mutually exclusive. So, and remember that when we talk about mutually exclusive, we mean that there's no events in common here. So we're going to roll a die here. The first event is rolling an even number, and the second event is rolling a prime number. Now, is it possible for a prime number to be even? And the answer is yes. The one example is two. Now, can you roll a two on a dice? Yes. So these are not mutually exclusive. There is an, there is an outcome that they share. Take a look at this one. Selecting a gift. The first event is that the gift is edible, and the second event is that the gift is a CD. Okay, now I'm trying to imagine a situation here where you could get a CD. Now we're, in, we're assuming a working CD, uh, and yet it'd still be edible. Uh, I'm not seeing that happen, so I'm going to assume that those are mutually exclusive, okay? That there's no overlap between those two sets. Cutting a deck of cards, the first event is that the card is a spade, the second event is that the card is a face card. Is it possible that you can have a face card that is a spade? Yes, the jack, the queen, and the king of spades. Uh, those are all face cards that are spades here, so these are not mutually exclusive events. They do share, an out uh, well, they share three outcomes. How about playing a game of hockey? The first is event is that your team scores a goal, and the second event is that your team wins the game. Okay. Now, are these mutually exclusive? Now, think about that. Now, because because sometimes people jump on this real quick. Other times, people are going to struggle with this a little bit. Is it possible that you can win the game and not score a goal? Well, now think about the only situation where where that where you, you might kind of think about that is what if we don't score and the other team doesn't score? Well, then you've tied. You didn't win the game, right? You need to score a goal to win the game. So no, these are not mutually exclusive events. You, you need to have scored a goal to win the game. 